This is a beautiful courtyard. But uh, I'm at the dentist's office, as some of y'all remember. And this is, I'm kind of late. So that's why I'm just like, my brace is up there. It hurt. It should hurt. 
This is a, a beautiful courtyard. But, um, so, um, it's been a month, a couple of months or whatever since I've done an update. But uh, everything has been going pretty good. I had a, a, a few problems because I've kind of been eating ice. So I popped some ligatures. Ligatures are the um, little rubber bands that go on, on the bracket. So I popped a few of them and I had to take, and the wire came off. The wire that holds everything together uh, came off and it just came out. So my whole bottom row had nothing on it for a few weeks. Um, and the bracket came loose. The bracket is the little silver thing. This one came off, so she had to replace that one. Um, but yeah, well, other than that, everything has been cool. They, whatever they did down here, this to bring, I have a tooth here that has to come up and get into the row. That's why that, why well, y'all always see that one kind of out because this one is coming up, pushing it. And then, then they're going to bring, all those are going to align together. So, um. Um, my my procedure, this procedure probably is going to take me about maybe three years um, to to get everything done. I think uh, I don't know if I'm saying it right. Uh, it'll be complete. My braces journey will be complete in three years. So because of my my bottom row, um, I thought I was getting a power chain today, but I'm not. And then they did. Remember I told y'all they did ask me to get those get some teeth extracted but I don't want to because I just don't want to get four healthy teeth um, taken out or whatever um, so whatever they're doing is they're they're redirecting whatever path they were going to do at first to to another one for me so which is fine for me because um, and it's fine financially for me because I really didn't want to pay an extra four or five hundred dollars for uh, for, for teeth extractions. So I really didn't want that. Um, uh, on top of the $5,000 braces. So, um, or 3000 No, it's 5000 Um, everything feel kind of tight. I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do because I, really, I want some ice right now. <laughs> but I'm, I'm going to see what I can do with the ice. I don't want to really fuck nothing up. Well, everything feel real real tight right now not not i'm not in pain so to speak but just real tight um and the staff is was beautiful to me again very nice everybody's very calming and atm atmosphere is very um pleasant the the nurses not nurses what are they i guess techs i don't know what they call um dentists no these are orthodontic people I don't know what they call, but very pleasant, very nice. Um, the same lady fixed them this time, the one that did the first time, uh, Andrea. Um, Dr. Bright came in to check to see, um, to I guess to check on the bone movement, the teeth movement or whatnot. So there has been some, but I can kind of feel it anyway. And I can sometimes I can feel my teeth um, shaking. They can kind of they shake like you have a loose tooth, but not loose to where it's coming out. But I, they, it feels weak a little bit, but that's because the jawline and everything is um, is moving. But um, yeah, every, every, you know, other than that, everything is fine. Um, I'm having a peaceful journey so far. I haven't had to have no stitches. Um, I haven't had any bleeding. Um, my breath does not stink. Um, I do um, have a. a a water pick or whatever so I can clean um, water pick in between my teeth and my gums and uh, it has enough power where it moves the gums a little bit out the way to kind of get up in there so I do that every day so no I don't have a breath problem people say that you you know you have a breath problem it's raining harder you have a breath problem when um, you have braces some people do some people don't I don't uh, I kind of I make sure that because I, I'm a singer I'm a music major so I'm running my mouth and my mouth is open all day. And I'm next to people singing and all that kind of stuff all through the day. So I damn sure don't want my breath stinking. <laughs> and, and, and if I feel like it stank or something like that, I sometimes I check myself 
um, after I eat, I don't have a water picking me after I eat. So I'm just like winging it, like making sure nothing's in my teeth. Uh, with my tongue or checking checking a mirror or whatever, make sure it's in my teeth. But stuff is still in there you can't see. So I have a breast spray, the like old the old school, you know, back in the day. Um, it was breath mints and stuff, but you know you had to be quick spray if you didn't want nothing in your mouth, no candy nothing in your mouth. So I do have that um, to hit hit my breath up just in case. And you can get that from the Dollar Tree. Um, let me see. I got a new toothbrush. Um, I buy a new toothbrush maybe every two to three months. I think you're supposed to, but I, I, um, I think you're supposed to do it anyway. But I've never really done that. I never buy two. Well, I didn't have to because you, I used to used to use the manual ones, and they came in packs. So when that one got bad, I throw it away and use another one. But now I'm using electric ones and. They come with different, you can buy different heads for them, but I don't buy a different heads for them. I just buy another one because Walmart puts them on clearance. So whenever I go to the to the um, the section for um, oral hygiene section, I just get another one. I, I just bought another one. So um, I do use, my toothpaste I use is, uh, I use two toothpaste every day. Um, the um, charcoal, activated charcoal and coconut oil um toothpaste i'll show it to you and um hello it's called hello um i'm gonna have to show that to, to show that to y'all but yeah those are the two that i use um i do i brush my tongue and all that kind of stuff i use for mouthwash i use dr Titian. that's it's kind of it's kind of strong it's actually very fucking strong but I like the, I like the clean effect. I like to feel my I like my mouth to feel real real clean, especially with these braces in, because I don't want that funky breath syndrome. But um yeah, that's pretty much it <laughs> with that. I'm gonna go probably get me something to eat and get out this weather because the um the streets are kind of flooding a little bit. So I had to really drive careful getting over here to 18 wheelers and shit. Actually, this place is on Mason Road. I live in Katy, and this uh, the doctor's office is on Mason Road uh, here in Katy, Texas. But uh, which is West Houston? You know, people don't know that. I do live in West Houston, on the west side. But um, yeah, it's raining. I'll be right back. Yeah. Um, I went to the opera. I'm gonna go show y'all those clips at the end. But yeah, I'm at the ghost store with baby. And um yeah, just at the ghost store getting food and stuff. But um yeah that that was it y'all. I ain't had enough else to do. After I finished eating, I took a nap, let the dog out and uh, that was pretty much it. But what? I look rough. But this is a video I was doing from earlier. I know, I tried to realize you put up in these I wasn't not showing your face. This is my video. <laughs> I was about to pop my head in your video. Then why you just do that and stop all the rest of shit? Thank y'all for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And hit the notification bell and stuff like that. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.